everyone. Welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the Crew. It's Tuesday, which means it's time for another Dollar Tree video to see what is new this week. We post these videos on Tuesdays and Fridays, and this is for Tuesday, August the 23rd, 2022. So let's go shopping. We're going to start in apparel and accessories. They just have the same kind of style t-shirt, just a different brand out this week. They have all of them in a v-neck and they were all ladies small. That is the only size I found and I found these at three different stores. They have 100% cotton, it has the easy tear away tag and these are the Love and Tell brand. I found them in orange, teal, red, black, white, and blue. They also had some Gildan brand wicking moisture performance t-shirts and some of the long sleeve shirts for children in the Gildan brand over in arts and crafts. They had some more of these buffalo plaid signs that have the fabric on the back and the chalkboard on the front. There's two different versions. They also had some more of the galvanized metal signs that look like a pig. They had a rooster and a cow. So these are repeat items. They're starting to bring back the apples and fruit, which they did have out last year at back to school time. So I am finding a few of those each time I go to the store and they are starting to bring back the retractable holders for like paintbrushes, colored pencils. These are really nice. They actually expand to double the size. You can keep rolls of vinyl in these if you like. So they're pretty versatile. Over in the health and beauty aisle, we'll start with the cosmetics first. There wasn't a whole lot new there as well, but they do have some new, um, nail polish out they have the new color gel polish it does not need a uv light to be used they have um, the red a melon a light pink soft peach kind of orange yellow and green also they have these p2 minute mani nail polish they had them in several different colors um, i found these in these clear boxes down on the bottom shelf at two different stores it says it dries in 60 seconds it's a gel look polish but again you don't need the light um, to use this polish and i'm just getting you guys some close-ups of all the different colors. I actually did purchase one. I really like it. It seems to cover really well with just one coat, um, which I thought was really nice. And when I looked these up at walmart.com, they're actually $3.94 a bottle. So for $1.25, you're getting a pretty good buy. They also had some more of the China Glaze brand nail polish. I found about seven different colors. A few are glitter, and then you have their solid colors. If you look these up at walmart.com, they range in price from $6 all the way up to $10. So over in the hair care they have some of the suave brand um, deep conditioning mask this is the almond and shea butter also some of the rave all smooth anti-frizz hair mask and then the salon select is frizz control and instant repair gels a few new um, scrunchies this week they have the satin red blue and black and these are the ones with the accessories black tag um, it's called fashion accessories uh, with the black tag there and then they also had some of the green and gray tagged items these are the soft pink and tan color you can get the fashion accessories with the um, kind of velvet feel to them they have those in four different colors and i love the one with the curled edges they had these out a few weeks ago in july and they just brought these back in this week so they have them in blue tan and pink you can get a matching head wrap as well then they had their satin headbands with the spots in the light green blue and tan and those are the green and gray tag brand. They are also starting to bring in their last minute gift ideas, which is the hair accessories that they put out at Christmas time. It's a box set. You get the um, elastics with a scrunchie. Um, they're pretty similar to the ones they had out the last few years. You get the dark navy blue, black with some gray mixed in and the dark burgundy red. Um, you can get the scrunchie with a large bow or the elastics with the scrunchies. They have both versions. I also found this new Clean Repair Argon Shampoo and Conditioner back at the Dollar Tree. For the pharmacy and personal care items this week, they have out the bath soaks. These are the hydrating bath soaks with the rose water and aloe and watermelon mint. Also the peony and pear hand wash. These are the full-size bottles. 
And then I was excited to see they had restocked the under eye jade rollers. I know these are really popular the first time they uh, made an appearance about a month ago at our store. Over in the men's, they had the power stick shave foam for face and body in two different scents. They also had some of the pumice stones in the two different sizes restocked. They come in lots of different colors and the anti-shave um, stick the thigh relief and the lotion was restocked they also had these new toothbrushes with the capsules and for fun finds they put out a bunch of these magic towels this week ours have been empty for probably two months now at most of the stores i've been to so they have all of these restocked and i did notice they had some new ones out especially a lot of the paw patrol and the mandalorian then they had some new movies for kids, lots of the Play Mobile style movies and just cartoons and things like that. There's a whole bunch of them, too many to show them all. For home decor, they had out these glass vases in four different colors, lots of different framed art. Um, there's just a couple different boxes that they have out recently. And then for the kitchen and pantry, they have the um, jars that have the copper or kind of like a rose gold colored lid with the um, lattice work on the sides. These dishes are restocked at most of the stores. These sell out really quickly. So if you want this style of dishes with the dotted pattern, I would not hesitate to pick them up because they will not be there when you go back, at least not here in Texas. They have a lot of their um, metal looking charger plates and trays and then the buffalo plaid washcloths that match a lot of the range covers that they have out also the soup bowls are starting to be restocked um, they get these usually about once a year they have them in the red the white and the blue of this style we get different styles throughout the year but it seems like around here we just get this style about once a year at the end of summer they also have some of the new um, kitchen tools these are the avocado slicer that top part swings open and it shows that you can use it to mash the avocado in a bowl they of course have the zester which i've been showing you guys off and on the last few weeks the garlic roll chop and then they also had the double um egg slicer you get two different egg slicers and the pickle fork this is really nice it actually straps to the jar and they have two different rubber pieces that will fit on two different size jars on friday i showed you guys they had these monogram towels now in blue and then they had some of the brown rice in these um, keto vegan free boxes so check those out in the pantry aisle and the jeff puff marshmallow is also um, back out for fall over in the office supplies they had a whole bunch of these crock pot um, recipe books they had the party supply this one was the chilies and stews they have dump recipes and then this one is the holiday recipe book you get about 45 recipes in each book they had one called fall favorites and then simple one two three there's just three steps in making each of the recipes the five ingredients or less cookbook i think there's 76 recipes in that one they also have the reese's pieces recipe book has lots of different desserts in there to try the philadelphia um, holiday desserts cookbook there's just some examples so they have full-size pictures and then uh, the recipe and some of them even have them small enough so you can cut them or tear them out to make recipe cards Then they had the jumbo um, calendars with the large print i really like these because you open them up and the double pages make one full calendar um, with larger squares that you could write in and then they had the um, 2023 calendar set that has the calendar at the top a notepad and some tear away list pads down at the bottom and those coordinate um, color wise and theme with whatever the border is around the calendar at the top it has a spiral metal um, loop at the top so you can hang these up and here's a close-up of the little list pads down at the bottom so there's quite a few different ones and they always sell them at back to school time and when the new year hits they're actually really hard to find calendars which always 
is astonishing to me. You would think that at the start of the new year, they'd put out the calendars, but they do not. Over in Housewares, if you guys have been looking for them, they have more of the pink and red night lights. Usually they only carry them in blue. So if you've been looking for the pink and red, I'd keep your eye out for them because they don't get them in very often. Over in Party Supplies, they had a bunch of these new boxes. Um, the lid is attached, but it like folds over the front end so it just has the hinge opening in the back they have a lot of glitter on these which i know not everyone's a fan of glitter on their gift boxes but they are really pretty there's lots of different um ones with like butterflies flowers the scalloped edge a bunch of different like color schemes and stuff so they're worth checking out because they are a really pretty box and it's nice that you could use these as a gift um, wrap and then you don't need any extra ribbon or bows I think this purple one here with the butterfly is definitely my favorite with the roses down the side. Then they had this pack of ribbon. Usually they just have Christmas colors. It was nice to see them get some variety in. And the last thing I found in the party section is the Let's Fiesta mini hats. You get three of these little red hats in each pack and the candy containers they have these restocked and they are in both sizes the seasonal items will start with fall it's mostly thanksgiving items that you could use for um, fall all the way through thanksgiving they've got these felt leaves sunflowers and pumpkins back in they have them in the dark red and orange for the leaves the sunflower has the glitter in the center and then the pumpkin and they do all have some form of glitter on each one sometimes they get them without the glitter right now they were covered in glitter they have the color your own ornaments in eight pieces already has the whole pre-drilled at the top with the twine hanger they have a pumpkin an acorn the little cups of coffee or cocoa they have the fox which we saw last year and the leaves so those are all restocked this year the led lights with the mesh ribbon in orange purple and green they do take batteries you need two double a's and their stickers are restocked so i think it was last week i showed you guys they brought back a lot of the stained glass looking stickers some of the 3d stickers with the gnomes that are holding um, coffee and pumpkins they have the leopard print pumpkins back in and the hanging signs i know these are new this year they came out um, i think in early august and they were um, sold out pretty quick so those are restocked these aluminum uh pumpkins here that say fall gather in autumn there are three different ones with the raffia bow at the top those are back out and these little signs that you can sit on a shelf they have the trailer and the coffee cup they're about an inch thick so they're pretty nice uh signs for a dollar 25 then i thought we had seen all of the floral we were going to see for fall um usually once they get what they have it's about all you see but they actually have restocked these um quite often so the last time i was at the store uh, just a few days ago this whole section was literally empty which surprised me because it was just jammed full of fall floral but it went really really quickly and so i was happy to see them restocked i really love the new mums that they have out with the eucalyptus leaves attached they look very farmhouse kind of feel they have them in several different colors and they remind me of some of the flowers they have over at hobby lobby they also have some of the floral garden eucalyptus leaves in the bundles they have the green that has a little bit of orange at the top yellow that has some orange and tan down at the bottom to look like fall leaves that are fading different colors they have the soft tan and the deep red with the orange or you can get the red with the burgundy they also had the tall grass with the um, feathers mixed in and quite a few different bundles and colors of those and then again just all the for fall floral that's been restocked they have some more of the glass pine cones and acorns if you haven't seen them yet. I've seen them restocked a few times so far. So hopefully they will make sure that they make their rounds to your store. They have this deco mesh with the glitter. This one says it glows in the dark. I don't know if it does or not. It says it does, but then they brought back the um, tool that has a lot of the gold floral on it and the kind of copper looking flowers they have the in off white pure white and then the glitter they also have these ribbons of the glitter it's a wired ribbon so you get it in green red or orange here's a close-up of the green one and then the halloween items they have their led um, flowers these are really cute they are a rose and they light up in the center it's got the fiber optic um, little lights right there in the middle 
then they had them in quite a few different colors. You could get them in red. They had white. And then this one was black with the white light in the center. You could also get the purple, and it's got a bluish purple color light in the middle. And then the red one that had the orange light in the center. I found some more of these amber colored bottles that have different tags on them. Let's say things like the Witch's Brew and um, like Wool of Bats, things like that. Those have the cork at the top. They have some of their ceramics that you can paint. They have two different uh, sugar skulls and an owl. And I know they're putting out some different pumpkins and scarecrows. Um, if you haven't seen those yet, a few of their metal signs, they had the jack-o'-lantern, a ghost, there is a witch's hat as well, and their DIY wood signs, they have a lot of those out. They seem to slowly be trickling out a lot of the wooden DIY signs and color your own um, ornaments and things that they had out last year. They're just very slowly coming out. It seems like they haven't got them all in like one big shipment. I don't know if that was lack of space due to the back to school items or what, but they also have a lot of their small canvas boards with the paint and paint brushes with the little miniature easel. Those are also making their way out now that the, most of the kids have gone back to school in our area. And then they have this large box with um, the fall colors of paint. It is washable paint. They have those restocked. And then the pumpkin decorating kit. So these are the hard plastic pieces that you can put into a pumpkin so you don't have to carve them. And hopefully the pumpkins will last throughout the season uh, before you know, they rot, you know, hopefully they won't rot before a Halloween. They have their carving kits out. And then the light up LED jack-o'-lanterns with the glitter that are in black and in orange. They also have the jack-o'-lantern lanterns. Uh, they are just the orange glass with the jack-o'-lantern face. It does have a hanger on it. These are the candy corn picks that are covered in the small little foam beads. They have a three pack pick or just a larger candy corn um, they've restocked the fabric and then they brought back these ghosts that they had out the last few years as well as these jack-o'-lantern uh, goblins here and the large skeletons. They also had their foam tombstones in. There's a whole bunch of different ones in each box. They also had these new skeletons. It's a bride and groom skeleton, which is kind of funny. They're wearing a wedding dress and a tuxedo. They have their sugar skull table decor. Some of this will hang some of them over the table, but it's got the honeycomb dress that you open up so she can stand. You get one in purple and they have one in the bright pink dress. They also have the sugar skull tray. It's a large plastic serving tray. They have the hot pad holders, the oven mitts, and some kitchen towels. So here's the flower sack towel. And there they are all together. I'm hoping you guys can get a better view. They had some of the small um, pails. These are like that aluminum little pails with the different color handles. Each one has a different uh, sugar skull pattern on it. Then they had some of these wall borders. Looks like dripping blood. They had a ceiling decor with the spider webs. I think it has spiders that hang down. And also the window covers with the caution tape. Or you can just get the fright tape that you can put around different like doorways and things. They also brought back the um, spider webbing. I think they only had it in white so far. Now for the Dollar Tree Plus items, which are the three or five dollar items. So for three dollars, you can get this hanging sign with the three wooden pumpkins that say grateful and white. The blue one says thankful. So it's grateful, thankful. And then the green one at the bottom says blessed. It's not bad for $3. They also have these love potion candles. The whole thing is a candle. I believe these were $5 each. They have two of them, the purple and the blue. You can get the rib cage candle and then the beauty elixir, which looks like a potion, a bottle of like potion. And they have different colors of wax inside. So it will drip down the outside. They had one that said poison. Then the $5 tapir candles. They're two pack of 12 inch candles. It says it's a bleeding candle. They have um, the skulls that are stacked on top of each other. So you get the white skulls. They also had the two skeletons, which are the tapir candles to turn them sideways to get the whole thing in the picture. You can also get the stacking skulls in silver and they also had them in gold. 
and there's supposed to be a bleeding candle that drips and they had them in this large box they're five dollars each then i found these three dollar uh sock pairs you get 10 pairs of socks it's called sock hub so 10 pairs of socks for three dollars they're the low cut socks i just love these i think they're really cute so for each pack you get about three plain pairs of socks and then the other pairs have a large uh, character or picture design on the side. Now, the cardboard that the um, socks are actually wrapped in at the side has a little tiny picture, which will show you all the different designs and sayings in each pack of socks. So like this one has sushi, it has olives, has a can of tuna, an orange pizza, and an avocado. And then the rest of them will be just a solid uh, color of socks you can see all the different pictures they're really well done um, for how inexpensive they are I was pretty surprised um, they have a bunch of different sayings on them like the olives say I'll love you you know it's like a play on words and then they had the sushi and things so then this pack here will have a watermelon an apple banana grapes and an orange so you can see the watermelon the pictures are really bright. I actually think they're not too bad of a sock. They're thin, obviously. You get what you pay for, but to just wear around the house. I know my kids go through socks like crazy, so I try not to pay a ton of money for them. So here's like the apple, and then they have an avocado. So they're really bright and colorful. They're very soft. This pack has some different cactus, a cup of coffee, a donut, co uh, like a latte and then it's got an ice cream cone and a taco and i don't know if you guys saw the video that i posted on friday but in case you did not i wanted just to make sure you guys knew that these summer toys are on clearance for a dollar 25 they have ladder golf the large giant checkers can slam and they had yard golf and they are all a dollar 25 i bought a few of them so this is the ladder golf i'll put together it's pretty tall um, it comes up to um, my waist. So it's pretty tall. They got the slam can there. Your cat will love it if you have one. They just think that's the best thing ever. It's got a little window there. And then the large checkerboard. I love the checkers are actually wood discs. So even if you didn't want it for checkers, these wood discs could be used for crafting. And you get 12 white and 12 black. Okay, you guys, that's it for today's video. Don't forget we post these videos on Tuesdays and Fridays and DIYs on Thursdays. Here's some of the things we made last week. So you guys might want to check out that video to see how we made them. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. I hope you guys have a lovely week. I'll see you back here Thursday to see our DIY video and Friday to see what's new at the Dollar Tree. Have a great one.